Hey, what's up, chat? What's up, what's up, everyone? Good day, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are, and good day, and welcome back to Cross Map World. And today we have another set of American Truck Simulator. Um, it's Solar Tuesday. Uh, it's been a while since uh, we did American Truck, but today we are back and we're going to try still to join with the truck a 389 glider. Um, and then we're just going to probably just use the default trailer for today just to make the most of it. So, everyone, good morning, good morning, welcome back. Uh, let me see if everything is correct and okay. So far, it looks okay. So far, it looks good. Hey, BB Gaming, what's up, my friend? How are you doing today? Nice to see you here. I saw you a while ago in SESL, bird. that was so cool. I think they're streaming right now. Hey, what's up, uh, Sabi? For Sabe or Jabe? <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Uh, hell yeah, yeah, all right, cool. So guys, uh, please stick around, you know, if you feel free, if you're not doing anything, game, there you go, oh my god, I told you game, <laughs> I'm so sorry, my friend, I, this, seriously, I do apologize, because um, it's, it's really my weakness to remember names and everything, so, <laughs> but I hope you, 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 you forgive me, understand. Hey, Mr. Kuzo, what's up to you? Oi, oi, I'm doing great, how are you? I'm doing good, my friend, I'm doing good. So, um, actually, um, yesterday and the other day, I do have uh, connection issues. Um, a while ago, the uh, internet provider was here. It was four guys, four of them, working on my net because it's still going in and out. So they said um, it's the best that they could do. So what's happening with my internet if, if, if my, my landline rings, automatically my connection will be disrupted. So they said that they need to request to the head office to migrate my port to a new port. It's like a, a box in the pole or the electrical pole that is kind of elect uh, power interrupted by the current of the pole. So they have to transfer that to a new one for me to have that this problem. And they said it might take a week or even months. It depends on the um, severity or how quick will the head office gonna respond to the request. So I really hope that there will be no issues with our connection today. I hope it's gonna be smooth and everything. But we'll never know. We'll never know. So in, in connection to that one, um, and really having a hard time um, thinking if I will do convoys on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, because that would definitely potentially gonna be a disaster, disaster first. But we'll never know. We'll see what will happen. So let's not wait time and let's hop inside the game uh, let me see let me see let me see let me see um, I think everything's good let me just pull it up here yep I think we're good uh, one two three four let's put it to four four only let's do it four give me a second I'm just trying to fix something there you go cool now let me pop this up there you go this one's better I think yep this one's cool um, yep we're good is it good yeah i think so um give me a second i'm just trying to fix my configuration here there you go uh-huh nope there you go okay cool now we're good we're good all right let me see hey what's up miss canada how are you doing today um how are you all i'm fine nice derek field nice to see you here my friend miss canada in the house as well so uh what do we have to do oh we have to check first the map just to make sure that we will go to a route that i haven't been to actually this is my second profile so most likely uh, some of the fi uh, routes here i haven't been to yet so it looks like this one let me double check all right let me go down here so it looks like the initial route we haven't been well technically i have been there already so we're gonna move that over here so yep, we're good on taking this route. So we're going to Pocatello, I think that's how you pronounce it. Pocatello in Idaho. All right, cool. Let's go. Hey, Lab Girl, what's up? How are you doing? It's nice to see you here. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Let me hop inside the game. So I'm, I'm watching SES here right now with my Samsung Fold. <laughs> because on the TV up there, um, where, what do you call this? I'm watching the rigs and everything. So we're watching SES software here on my phone. Um, later on, I'm going to put my, my mug in there. So at the moment, I'm using my phone to watch SES. So you might hear them from the back on the background from time to time. Let me just turn up the volume, though. There you go. So that you can listen to them. I'm not so sure if you can see it, though. 
But yeah. So yeah, cool. All right, what do we have to do now? Oh, we have to start and moving. Um, I'm gonna change this to speed. Yeah, I think we're good. Uh, let me check first the display fuel we have 290 gallons so that will be approximately 2,000 miles so we're good oil temp 185 water temp 178 so we're good yeah we're good to go all right cool let's check the horn all right everything's okay now let's go and start to move how are you doing everyone i really like this driver perspective ah thank you so much for that one holistic ttv i really appreciate the the, the positive um response from me my friend i appreciate it thank you thank you all right here we go here we go i'm gonna activate the engine control because we do have a fuel at the back so we, we want to make sure we want to stop as quick as possible to avoid any casualty end right away i just hit the side of the of that um is this is the yes is this email this is the john do the trade nine glider i just hit something right away what the f whoops <laughs> i can see it from the from the side mirror though no, but i think we're good yeah we're good oh dang it i oh I, I was hitting something i'm hitting something no no we're good let me just uh all right cool we're good hey what's up sir dog how are you doing today logging miles for our VTC uh, GPS, let me check this. There you go. We're good. Okay, we're gonna make a right turn. I'm gonna put the most lowest part of our the back tire of the trailer. Yeah, exactly, exactly. That was. Do you have a a good uh, keen to detail boss holistic? All right, we're good. Yeah, we're good. Great truck I own, also Highway Killer by Ruda along with... Cla yeah, Emil. John Ruda's truck is, I would say, um, if there are any modded trucks out there, um, definitely John Ruda is one of the great truck mods that is on, I would say, a very good price. Because there are other truck mods out there, which is super expensive. But John Ruda, at a price of 25 bucks, you get this lovely quality. What more could you ask for? Um... Nice to see everyone back in chat. Nice, Derek. Nice to see you. I love to play ETS and ATS. I look carefully to the mirrors when I aim close to build. That's really a good pointer, my friend. That's a really good pointer. I'll keep that in mind as well. Just playing some Horizons. Oh, nice, sir, dog. Nice, nice. Hey, sir, dog. Make sure that you um, um, you're gonna play the day before when it's out, sir, dog. Right? Oh, we have a new follow right away, sir, dog. You're gonna play the day before when it comes out. You're gonna play it with us, right? Logan, you. Um, I think B240 Tick as well. Um, goofball, I think is going to play that one Snow Apocalypse. So there's a lot of people. So we can create um, a lot of people to play that game at the same time. But before we do that, I would like to make a big shout out to our newest and family member, Pablo Chacon. I hope that we could ask him to everybody. Welcome to the family and thank you for the follow. So, all right, cool. Did I miss any turn? No, I think we're good. Yeah, I think we're good. Can I see the truck? Sure, Matthew, my friend. No problem. I'll definitely want you to see. So currently, we do have a truck here. It's called um, John Ruda 389. So as you noticed, we have here um, a skin by Frag. It's Manolin Monroe. On the other side, you have her signature. On this side, you have uh, like a film or something. So yeah, so this is our skin for the moment, and together with Bao Bao's uh, lovely tires, it's a pretty cool, right? Pretty cool. Hi Matt, sorry if I upset you, and uh, Mr. Trudon. Um, Mr. No, Ian, you s no, you didn't disappoint me, my friend. Oh, you upset me? No, you're all good, my friend. Ian, you're all good. How are you? How are you? Very nice truck, very posh ended. Oh, thank you, thank you. A uh, classic style tires. Thank you, thank you, my friend. Uh, Ian, my friend, you're good, you're good. You never upset me or something. You're good, my friend, you're good, all right? Is the back okay? Yeah, I think we're good. So far, we're good. Yeah, we're cool, we're cool. How are you doing today, everyone? I hope everyone's doing a great time and a great day right now. So far, we're cruising here in Idaho. 
I can't really wait for either Montana or Texas to come out. I just wanted to see something um, like a new vibe, road, feel, scene in ATS. It's just going to be, I would say, absolutely phenomenal once either both of that um, DLC comes out. I think everyone is kind of excited as well to see where are we going to go with now. Hold on. Uh, this is kind of confusing. This is so confusing. What? Let me check my map first. This, my GPS looks... Uh, let me see. Let me see. Ah, because we have this. There you go. Now, I think it's, it's going to be pretty much... Okay, so SES, I think it's about to wrap up. listening to 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 the mirror at the moment email it's okay here i'm just waiting for answer from my friend so we will go out oh nice that nice. you have a great time then email if that happens oh okay he's done all right he, he rated um what's the name Trucky Casey, there you go. <laughs> She's surprised. <laughs> it's always, it's always that will be, um, I would say, the feeling when when the SES rated someone is always like gonna be a surprise. So that's so cool for for what's the name, um, Truck Cassie, uh, to have that kind of explosive. Um, what they call this explosive reaction <laughs> let me see where we at we're good look at her face <laughs> so far we're good we're okay thanks man no problem with me all good all good <laughs> Look at her face. Her smile. She can't contain her smile. <laughs> Where are we at? I'll be back just going to see SES stream. No problem, Emil. They just ended actually. They raided someone as you notice here. They raided, uh, what's the name? Um, Trucker Cassie. That's her name. So you might want to check Trucker Cassie. Yeah, you got some aloha. How are you living today, my friend? So let's close this one since oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh boss wild beard tv in the house how are you doing today how are you doing today boss thank you thank you so much for the raid big special shout out to our boss wild beard tv thank you boss and for the raid of party of 11 and thank you for trusting the community with me everyone welcome to the channel What's up, Raiders? What's up? How are you doing? How are you doing, everyone? Um, Boss Wildbird, how are you doing today? I appreciate the raid, though. Thank you, thank you. Uh, um, Mr. Tuto, can you do me a favor? If you could kindly type exclamation love Wildbird TV, I would appreciate that. Thank you so much. I actually saw you a while ago, but I was setting up my my stream so i wasn't able to hop into your game but i know that you're always gonna shoot someone in armor tree <laughs> man yesterday i got a haircut oh nice aloha that's a cool one that's a cool one my friend so uh boss wildbeard how are you how was your stream how was your stream hey what's up peter Selly? good day to you my friend boss wildbeard again thank you for the raid boss i appreciate it i'm trying to slow down here we have you follow right away Give me a second, give me a second. A shout out to Michael Myers. Thank you, boss, for the follow. Welcome to the family. Guys, um, if, you, if you don't know yet, Boss Wildbeard TV Gaming, um, you have to check him out. This guy, when he plays Armature, it's, it's kind of like um, the game itself is good. 
it's already good. But when when Boss Wildbird is playing this, the way he controls his chopper and the way he do the role plays, uh, you know, trying to infiltrate enemy camps, it's just it's just like a reenactment of what might happen on the actual field. So that's what one I would say concept or content from from his end that you're gonna love. So you have to check him out. And if you haven't followed him, you're missing a lot. Please extend the love and support. And of course, give Boss Wildbeard Gaming a follow. Hi, Matt. Are you good? Yes, I'm good, Ian. Thanks for asking. I missed something. Hey, guys. Hey, Matt. My dear little sister wants her daddy right now. So I sadly get a raid and roll. Have a great stream, brother, and, have, and a great Easter. Oh, my gosh. Thanks, Boss. Boss. You have a great time, and then thank you to again for for the raid. I appreciate it, boss. See you soon. See you soon, my friend. <laughs> oh, TOS. No, no problem. No, seriously. I mean, that's really fascinating about your stream, the armor tree. So, so I don't want to take too much of time because I know that your 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 little sister wants her dad. <laughs> so have a great time. Are you gonna do Easter hug, uh, uh, Easter egg hunt? What's wrong with my? speech nowadays <laughs> i always try to mispronounce a lot of words i've been good ian how have you been now oh, nice did i miss anything on the chat um that's supposed to say a daughter <laughs> yeah i was gonna like sister so I, I thought i thought i thought you call your daughter sister because like for me um my, my eldest uh son i call him kuya kuya stands for big brother so I call him Kuya. So I kind of like think that's how you said it, but it's okay. It's okay, my friend. All good. All good. So currently we are just cruising here around in Idaho at the moment. So I don't haven't seen so much traffic in a while. I don't know what's happening. Are you trying to avoid me? <laughs> it could be. It's a possibility. They don't want to be near me. Is there any vehicles at my back? Let's check it out though. Oh, there is. So I'm creating traffic actually. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm the one who's creating the traffic, not them. Ain't that a good thing? Yes, it is. It is. It is a good thing. But you know me, uh, Matthew, I love traffic. I love AI traffic, even though a lot of people doesn't like AI traffic in, in ATS or ETS2, I do love AI traffic. So like this one, we do have a, a police officer trying to pull his pull in front of us and we have a solid line in the middle so meaning to say i can't overtake <laughs> that will be an issue for us hey what's up Goof goofball <laughs> how are you doing today boss goofball nice for you to be here hey boss goofy i send you a message in discord you haven't responded check it out my friend and let me know what do you think <laughs> Goofball, that emote of yours can be really used in a lot of different ways. That one is kind of like, I would say, um, a general emote that can be used by anyone. So that is so cool. I like that emote, my friend. Thank you. Thank you, Peter Sally, for the exclamation love, Goofball. I appreciate that. Um, guys, if you don't know Goofball yet, you have to check him out. He's a good friend of ours. Really, really, uh, I would say the sense of humor of this guy is just phenomenal. You have to check him out. And I would appreciate it if you can extend the love and support and give Boss Goofball a follow. Thanks for the... You're welcome. You're welcome, my friend. You, you deserve it. Will Matt crash today? How many times? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> is it about crashing that you always wanted to see on my end? <laughs> I try to be a professional as much as possible. Okay, I think we're clear. It's kind of hard to pull in in an intersection without traffic light. Uh, I'm having a little bit of lag issues right now. And they need to run a, a car. No, we don't do that, Matthew. My license might be revoked if we do that. <laughs> I sent a Discord message, but they didn't see anything about a new... <laughs> Actually, when you played a while ago, SnowRunner, I was kind of like thinking I should revisit it. I did actually launch the game, I think, a week ago. And I was trying to configure the Joy to Key to work on my bottom box. But I was having a hard time, Boss Goofball. I'm seriously having a hard time right now. Because the last time that I used the Joy to Key was way back when I was streaming on the other platform. So it's really, there's a lot of, I, I forgot already, I have, I forgot already how to 
um, manage the joy to key so probably um, if you have a free time sometime you can help me out with that one because I don't know I'm I don't know if, if I'm doing it correct because I launched the game and then I open joy to key because I need to know what functions do I need to configure my joy to key and then it doesn't work when I do that so I exit the game exit joy to key launch joy to key then launch the game it still doesn't work how does it work how do you do it properly have you ever crashed in real life Matt um, driving a car no but I did my, my the only accident I could remember that um, involve a vehicle is that my side mirror on the right side hit um, the side of a wall but imagine that particular um, area where I'm driving is that it's really like the car is just enough to be fitted in there so you know I tried my best not to hit anything it's just really enough like just one inch probably of, of of allowance for me to park the car and for me to get out of the car I have to get out of the trunk I can't get out of the left um, of the of the door I can I have to get out of the trunk just to park the vehicle so that is the first one and the second one my back tire um, when I hit like it's a uh, it's a cover of uh, it's, it's not technically like a, a manhole but it's like a, a square type of cement that will be on top of the road my back tire got dumped in there because probably it's it's too old already so it's kind of crappy so that's the only accident I could remember with vehicles you should launch joy to go first so the game can detect its virtual oh, okay gotcha gotcha I'll do that again boss Google I have crashed many times in both games oh in games yes a lot no question about it it's one of my skills one of my skills in game is to crash <laughs> no question about it so if you want to learn how to crash join my crash course <laughs> I'll be happy to guide you in terms of how to do it but in real life as far as I know I could remember two accident which is my side mirror got a scratch and then the back of my tires got falling down on a square type manhole something like have you ever been in a semi no 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 Matthew no I haven't I, I did drove a closed van a closed van I did and then I mean it I did drive a truck but I mean to say in like a long drive no um, there was a time that in our company because I was the, the head of the logistics department and there's a lot of things happening right now and one of my truck are positioned in the middle of the parking and it's kind of like disrupting everything so I could have asked one of my drivers to move it then and everything because there's a lot of things happening that time so I'm the one who move it so that's the only time I drove a truck but it's just really kind of like just reverse it for f five seconds just to place it out of the main road yeah that's it um, have you ever played the day before the day after the day before <laughs> what is there a game like that when I was six I drove a 99 oh really wow Matthew hold on you're six years old you drove a Peterbilt truck but it's not moving right because if it's moving, how can you ever reach the gas or the brake? Huh? Hold on. What? So the vote is a 50-50 chance. So I would, cr uh, I would crash either one or five or more. Oh my god. <laughs> we'll see then. We'll see then. It was moving doing seven and down the highway. So you are sitting on top of your dad most likely. Matthew. I would, I would assume. I first drove a Peterbilt when I was 15. Oh, nice, Goof. Really? That, actually, Goof, I found um, this business in America. They're creating smaller size trucks. Um, I forgot the name, though. But they're creating a miniature of trucks. So it could look like an SUV, but in a, tr in a truck look. Have you heard about that one? Goof? I forgot the name though. But I saw a video of that one in YouTube. It's really cool. Like, um, the hell with those trucks. Which one? Um, I first... I, in his lap. Okay, gotcha. So, that's what I thought, Matthew. Alright, that, that is cool. I mean, I mean, imagine, like, for example, this 389 in a smaller scale. But when you look at the outside, it's, it's the same. But on a smaller scale, like a, an SUV size. Have you heard about that one, Google? It's a, it's a business company in US of A. 
And if if I'm if if I'm near that company, I would definitely gonna purchase one. That would be really cool to have. Yes, it's called a three five. Oh, really? That is that is really amazing. I mean that that small truck of a of a a miniature. What the heck would someone want to? Try? I mean not 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 for business goof. It's just for own personal. Um, let me see though. Let me see. Let me see. I, um, I no, actually, we'll do it some other. I, I might look for a video of that one goofball, and you have to watch it for you to understand how cool it is. I've knocked out a Peter Bill person when I was. <laughs> oh my gosh, these are too loud. <laughs> the Peter Bill I drove when I was a fifteen was my dad's three five nine. A three five nine is smaller Peter Bill, not as big as three seven nine. No, Matthew, no, not that one. No, not like a 359. It's way smaller. It's like the same size, I would say, of... Uh, like a, a little bit bigger than the hammer. Something like that. I forgot the name, though. But you have to check it out. Check it out right now in YouTube. Like a miniature American truck. It, it's really cool, though. It's really cool when they do that one. And, and it, it looks really amazing. It's smaller than that one, Matthew. I'm not talking about 359. It's way smaller than that one. Um, you can bypass. Okay, so we can bypass the waiting station now. We don't need to to go there. Let's just give them a horn. Just different features at Engine Bay. Gotcha. But I think that the more higher model of a 38, I mean of a Peterbilt, is just to... Um, Make it for them to configure to the most advanced technology, engine, chassis, I don't know, drive train, turbo, whatever you call it. That's probably the only reason because I think the older, like the 359, 379 might be configured to old technology. So as new technology comes out, they have to, to build this new one. But I've heard, but I've heard the most popular or most, I would say, um, model of Peterbilt that people likes a lot is the 379 is that correct goofball I've heard that 379 is has the most fan fan, fan base is that correct is it a 379 <coughs> I'm getting a little bit lag here having a little bit of lag issues <laughs> 379 is a very popular rig okay yeah I, I've heard I've heard that the majority of American people or American trucker prefers the 379 compared to other model or variant I, I, might, I might be wrong I might be wrong most people like the long nose speeder builds and associate with the 379. But in reality, most can sell the 35937. Oh, okay, gotcha. So they might look like the same in terms of um, looks. But more probably the difference between the three is going to be more on the configuration. The one I drove was a 1999 379 Peter build long nose. Oh, that's cool, Matthew. That is really cool. I mean that that will be like an awesome child experience to drive a Peterbilt even though you were six on on top of your dad's lap. I mean that memory is just gonna be, you know, really a good thing to remember. Okay, we're good. We're back on the right side. We don't want to be on the left lane. Because as far as I know, I mean, here in, the, in, in our country, um, if you're like a bus or a truck, you have to be on the most right lane. You never use the middle lane or the left lane unless you're in the highway to do overtakes. I do it anyway. <coughs> wow, 750 horsepower. That is really a massive massive engine in. Uh, the one I drove, okay, I read the one. 
Hey, good evening, my boss buddy. Hey, what's up, boss mapper in the house? How are you doing today, boss? Hong Kong to you. Sorry, no, no musical horn <laughs> for American Truck Simulator, only for ETS2. It's top speed. Oh my, is it miles or kilometers? KMH or MPH, uh, Matthew? I would, I would assume it's KMH. MPH? What? For real? Without a load? Without a load? Just, a, just, the, just the head truck only. Without a load, probably. But with a load, I'm not so sure if that would be possible. 125 miles is. I'm not so sure though. I'm not so sure. I have no really clue. Oh my gosh, that is one freaking massive machine then, with a with a I would say a beast of an engine, 750 horsepower, hauling a 60k pounds of of load, and can still do 125 miles. That is freaking badass. Without a trailer, it loads. Oh my gosh. I don't even know if I can even. I mean, pro the, the 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 top speed that I've recorded on my end using a car was 132 on a highway, and the only allowed um, maximum speed for us here in my country is only 100 K kmh. I'm not talking about mph, so I'm not sure how do you convert that to mph. So I don't know. I don't know. It's, it's, it's really... I mean, the 130 plus for me on the car is already too much because it's so lightweight that I feel like my car is already a little bit floating. So that is that is really um, kind of dangerous already to go that one. That's like 60... 130 kmh? Is 60 mph? Are you, are you sure? Mm, do I have to make a right here? Right here? Not yet. Oh dang it. I uh, it always confused me with this GPS. <laughs> I have to zoom out a little. Um, my dad's 359 chassis had nearly 3 million miles. Oh my gosh. So your dad most likely goof um, toured the whole US or probably half of it. Yeah, it was tuned tune brand new turbo and everything. Oh that is so cool. That is why it has a massive um, engine probably it might be hauling a lot of uh, there's a road what could be the problem here let's try to talk to the people here if we can go in so I don't wanna well actually I think we can do reroute going down going up again yeah because there's a chopper it's gonna be hard for us to go through so I don't wanna risk it because our load is a fuel, <laughs> so I don't want to get some explosion. You, you want to stop by at McDonald's, probably? <laughs> yeah, I'm starving. <laughs> Me too, a little. I'm a little bit... Uh, I'm starving a little. straight it's just like a, a small detour because there's an accident on top of the highway that's why we have to pass here okay very good even though there's no vehicle that will pass there because there's an, an accident we still have to use our signals. Our 37 has like 25 million miles on it. Oh, on your dad. Wow, that is that is really cool. Uh, Matthew, I mean, both of your dad, Matthew and Goofball, are legendary truckers then for them to log that pretty much. So in, 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 in terms of years, Goof or Matthew, how long did your dad drive? Like a decade, two decades, three decades? How long? they start to drive uh, those trucks until they retire it's actually one of my dreams really to be a truck driver in real life but I don't want to do it here in the Philippines because it's so corrupt and the pay is really not that good here not to mention the traffic here is too much the traffic here is really really freaking bad so 
I don't want to spend half of my day just stuck in traffic. I would I don't mind driving a truck here if if I will be outside of of the city, but I don't know. My dad drove for 28 years. Wow. My dad drove the truck for about 20 years and it was used when he bought it. Wow. Oh, so your dad owned the truck. Oh. Hey, what's up, Domino Down? Gonna be in province of Dutch, the PH. <laughs> exactly, exactly, my friend. I agree, I agree. Domino, my friend, first time chat. How are you doing today? Hey, what's up to you, Darren? Thanks for the first time chat as well. Welcome, both of you. When we bought, when we bought, when we're about, huh? When we're, when we bought, <laughs> huh? <laughs> it's kind of confusing. When we, or it was crashed and we, when you bought the 379, it was crashed and rebuilt. It. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. But he drives a 25 Cascadia now. So, Goof, which one do you think is way better? I mean, if you're gonna, if you, on your own personal choice, I think you will go with the 379 of your dad. But do you think on your dad's side, does he prefers the Peterbilt or the Cascadia? Just got into ATS with some friends. These this week so randomly checking out streamers of it heard your mention philippines wifey is from mindanao oh nice nice mindanao is do have do have one of the most beautiful beaches here in the philippines i'm having dinner see ya mapper boss mapper have a great dinner uh left some some for me so that i could eat later he's older now he prefers comfort but he say the cascade breaks down <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean, I think not only on new trucks, but most of the new vehicle nowadays is just it just breaks down a lot. I don't know. It. I mean, I think it could be. It could be. Um, hold on for a second. Let me just do something because um, I need to do. Something. Okay. So, pro I mean, for me, I think nowadays, um, a lot of vehicles, not only trucks, but I mean, most of the vehicles nowadays. Do break down a lot. I'm not so sure if it's some sales strat strategy or marketing strategy for them to to be like that, um, just to get them sales parts and service and everything. But I don't know. It's just the reliability of parts of nowadays is just it's just really really nasty. And you know, compared before, like, when you have a vehicle, let's say for on my end, like a Toyota, a Honda. Or a Nissan, you would say this vehicle would last long, but nowadays I don't know. I don't know. Like almost all vehicle do have the same reputation. You know that the, the parts are kind of like nasty. It's just breakdowns a lot. I don't know why. It could be. It could be a, a sales or marketing strategy or style for them to get more profit. But I mean, I don't know. It might be just me. It might be just me. <laughs> Being new to ADS, what are some must-have mods? I have most of the state DLC. Um, boss, it depends on what really you need. But for me, I would say you get the Sizzle, S-I-S-L. Check that out. It's in Steam Workshop, so check that out, S-I-S-L. That's a must. There's two of it, the cabin and the trailer. You have to get both. If you don't want any damages, like you have to go to repairs and everything, there's a no damage mod as well in Steam Workshop, which, which you can also get. Uh, what else? Um, if you're looking for something specific, you can try to type it in the search engine. And normally when I try to look for something, I'm not so sure if it's going to be good or not. I always make sure that it has more likes, like subscribe like at least four stars and above so there's also categories like that that you have to check but again if you're looking for something specific there might be something that they will give to you um so you can check it out but if you have something specific you could ask and i might and let me see if i know something like that like trucks and motors and trailers um hold on hold on did i miss anything how are you doing darren i'm good thanks for asking my friend this is a second um cascadia it's not an owner operator now. It's drive a company lease truck. Oh, okay, got you, goof. Hey, what's up, Daniel Jennings? How are you doing? Kalum Kip in the house as well. Being new to 80s, I'd li like the truck and motors and trailers. The engineering is different. The engineering is different. Parts and pieces are smaller. Brakes easier due to the size and materials. In order to get things to function, we 
with the engine profile of modern time. Ah, okay, gotcha, good. Well, that, that's also kind of spot on in terms of why it's happening. But I think it's partly sales and marketing strategy as well for them to break down. You know what I mean? Hey, Domino Priv, text me on Twitch and I'll tell you. There you go. Thank, thanks, Matthew, for that one. I appreciate you help out Domino in terms of he needs anything. I'm doing like brilliant, boss. How are you today? I'm doing good, Daniel. Thanks for asking as well. Right now, we're just trucking here in USA. Um, pretty much okay. A little, I'm having a little bit of lag issue. I'm not so sure. But it looks like. It looks like. Probably some parts of the map I'm having issues now. He, um, Daniel. Uh, yeah, no problem. I have been on ATS for like two years. Now that is that is really cool for you to help uh, the community in terms they have if they need something. But again, um, my friend, if you have any specific mods that you wanted, um, just try to ask us here. But again, the two mods that you have to get is a Sissel, S-I-S-L. Type it in Steam Workshop and it will pop out. It's uh, the interior uh, and then also the trainer. Ow, is your internet still a bit broken? Yes, Daniel, a little bit, a little bit. Um, a while ago, there were four representatives from the internet provider here in my house because they can still fix the problem because I do have a power interruption on my connection to the pole. And get Viper Speed great, but there you go. That the Viper Speed is a really good mod as well, and Steam Workshop, my friend. Let's try to log. How far are we from our destination? Seven and seven miles to go. The RPM is still kicking in, so we cannot upshift. But I think 65. We're doing 64. 65 is gonna be okay. Most people prefer cars and trucks to cost less upfront and are all quit paying for them over time. Regardless if they admit it or not, I'm sure if people would pay a massive amount of money upfront and not gripe about it, auto trucks makers would use more expensive materials to make the product, but deep down that's not what they really want. I, I, I think I agree with that one goofball, but so far, um, I have a, a Mitsubishi Expander. I've owned it since 2018, brand new. I, I purchased it directly from the dealer. Um, the only issue that I have with the, with the vehicle for almost four years of using is one time that my battery, the car battery went local. That's it. Uh, the rest, no issues at all. So far, I'm lucky uh, purchasing the vehicle. Um, but a lot of different cars are always having pain in the ass. I'm not so sure why it's really happening that way. Where in PH are you located? Manila? Yes, yes, boss. Domino. I'm from Manila. Can I ask where I'm, when I'm convoying in TMP with you guys? You have the VTC unit next to your name. How do I get that? You have to press the tab, Daniel, and then right click your name and then apply tag. Or I think it's part of the settings. Um, you have to look at under the settings section. I'm not really that um, educated or knowledgeable in terms of TMP, but it's part of the tab. Then you have to go to settings, click tab, and then there will be a cogwheel at the bottom. You have to click that one. It will be the settings and everything, and that's where you can put your tag. There's a part or section of that one that you can... Yes, 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 that's correct. That's correct. That's the one, my friend. You're welcome, you're welcome, my friend. Oh, look at this rig on the left. I like it. Like you like it. He's the truck killer from Mandela. <laughs> but don't ask him to show his one. <laughs> oh, what happened? What happened to my... What happened to my gears a while ago? That was kind of going local. Hey, what's up, Boss Ash? How are you doing, my friend? <laughs> Good day to you, brother. Good day to you. Um, Boss Peter Selly, you still there, my friend? Or he might be AFK for the moment. Yeah, it could be. It could be. Yeah, gotta say that in a rap. <laughs> yeah. Um, Boss Peter Selly, can you do the exclamation love for Mr. Tutel? I would appreciate that. Guys, you have to check out Mr. Dutton, a good friend of ours as well. Streaming um, ETS and ATS as well. And I would appreciate if you can extend the love and support to him. And uh, also, Miss uh, Boss Peter Sally, can you do also exclamation love for 
Boss Ash PH. I would appreciate it. Manila would. Um, thank you, thank you, Peter Sally, my friend. I appreciate that one. Um, let me see, let me see. Um, oh, oh, dang it. I missed something though. Domino said Manila would be a nightmare to drive a rig. <laughs> I, I agree, my friend. That's why for me to, to become. Um, for me to become a truck driver here, it's not really, I would say, the best choice. No problem, no problem, Boss Peter Selly. I would actually ask you as well about Boss Ash, but you just made it on the other way around, so that's okay. <laughs> I'm streaming X back now sometimes. Oh, okay, Mr. Dusel. How was your PC, by the way? How was your PC? Uh, thank you guys for it. No problem, Boss Ash. I have, you're welcome as well. I appreciate you guys being here. I missed something though. Domino said Manila would be would be a nine metro driver rig. I, I loathe going there when we travel back to BH. <laughs> I try to spend as little as amount of time as possible. <laughs> I agree, my friend. It is, it is, it is gonna be a disaster. Um imagine this guys. I think it's just ten kilometers. Um, how would I say this? I think it was 10 kilometers from my home to my office. Was it 10 kilometers? Yeah, I think it's just 10 kilometers. It will take me one and a half hours. So back and forth, it will take me three hours to drive 20 kilometers. <laughs> so if you, if you don't believe what Domino said, I mean, seriously, that's how bad it is your ass is <laughs> exactly it would be better if you just drove a bike or a motorcycle it would be way easier seriously all right so that we are we just arrive in our there you go and guys look at this this is one thing that i really like about the the frank mod that i have the home garage because as you notice you, you see my logo up there that trailer right there the boss mat it's the reason because i have that home garage mod you see that trailer right there? You see that? That's the reason why we have it there. It's because of that mod. Pretty cool, right? That mod, that that particular trailer right there. That one, right? The boss map world right there. It's because I have the home garage. That's why you can see these scattered in the map. <laughs> it's just so cool. Give me a second to put our truck or our load into the parking. Watch out. Give me a second though. So when I look on the right side mirror i have to look on that one you might be wondering where you matt is looking on the left you see this uh front small mirror here that's that's the only thing i could use and it's kind of hard to see probably more on your end but that's the only options that i have so far we're clear on the left Give me a second chat, right? Okay. There you go, we can see it now. Come on. Make it 
too hard for me. I didn't. I just realized that the trailer that we have is freaking freaking long. That's why we're having a little bit issue a while ago when we were trying to make a turn. I didn't ever realize that this. this is freaking long. No, I'm not gonna skip. Stop asking me. One more and we're good. One more making the trailer and truck straight and we're good. Yeah, I think we're good now. Yeah, I think we're good. I just need to get that green thing. Um, we're a little bit on the right side, but we have still the green thing. I think I deserve a green thing with that one chat. What do you think? Green thing. Let me see though. Good job, right? It was kind of close on the right side compared to the left, but your green thing is your green thing. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Let's drop the trailer then. There you go. Pretty awesome. Nice. And let's change the time. Let's put it back to morning and pick up our next job. Give me a second. I need to go back to the chat though. I know I missed something. Um, I had to play my favorite sound blurb. <laughs> um, let me see. Your ass is that I read that you just you're you're just the one of the best drivers in this in the states. So they whip you. <laughs> it's Buang for sure. <laughs> Buang. <laughs> Took me nearly one and a half hours to get to the airport from near the embassy once. We get out and walk there in order to. <laughs> Oh my god. Doing currently a job from Regal Lat Latvia to Strip Macedonia. I use that. Oh nice, nice email. That is really a good truck, man. Um Nightmare Oh, what's that? Nightmare what long trailers? Not following with that one, my friend. Okay, let's go inside and resume to getting our next load. So far we did a good job with that one. It took a while, it took a while. It's it's like a couple of back and forth for us to make it shoot in that place, but you know, yeah, we're good. Um uh, I'm having the truck looks all pretty pretty and unrealistic. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> you don't like it, the goof, you don't like the truck. You don't like Manly Monroe? A smile is the best makeup any girl can wear. You don't like that one? <laughs> uh, let me see. Hold on. Uh, let's find a job, though. Oh, we have this one. We have the Kenworth truck and parts. But we're going back to Idaho. I don't want to go back there. Ah, this one's going to Oregon. Nope. That's freaking long. Let's take this one. Oh, we're going to Colorado. Oh... I don't want to go to Colorado. I've been I've been going around in this four state, so let's try the other side. Um, yeah, we could do this one probably, but it's five hundred. There's one more way for um, for me to do this. Is that I'm gonna change the time back to seven. That would give us a new set of loads. That's how I do it. <laughs> That's how I cheat the system. <laughs> okay. There you go. Oh, this one's freaking long. Uh, we're going up to Washington. Yeah, we can do this. Let me see. Um, Is there anything? What's, what's the difference? I don't see any difference, though. <laughs> I don't see the difference. It's like everything looks... Ah, there's a different... 
look on the tires i see i see okay so the tires is kind of it varies and it's different uh, we might go man, yeah, we might go with this one i think but it's a bigger one so i think a tree and yeah, let's do this one instead and let's pick it up then take the job Boss, I'm gonna truck in the background while listening to the stream. Have a great journey. Same to you, my friend. Drive, 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 save. I'm gonna reverse. Where's the load there? Oh, there's the load right there. Let's go inside so that we can pick it up. That is a one massive rock. Wow, that is one freaking big rock. I'm having a little bit of FPS drop though. I'm not so sure why. Rock and roll. <laughs> exactly, my friend. Uh, hold on. I'm having a. Alright, so let's check first the map just to make sure that the road that we will pass, I haven't been there yet, you know what I mean? Um, so we have been there, I think. So we're going to take a different route, should we? Uh, let me try to put it here. So you see that one? I have been there already. So we could take this, but it's going to be longer. That's a concern. We can go up here probably as well that we can take this new road and then there will be small part that we haven't been yet let me check so this one is a good one how about this one is that a good one yeah it's a good one so we're gonna take a little bit of detour going up here because this is the road that we have passed already so yeah uh now going back on the road happy trucking and don't crash i hope you'll be here you fix the internet so we can drive sometimes. No, no problem, email. Hey, just opposed to my friend. How are you doing? Thanks for the lurk. I appreciate it. Okay, we're good. We're good. Yeah, we're good. Let's turn off the the headlight and the beacon. Yep, that might help drop down the uh, lag issues that we're having. Or still, it's still lagging. <laughs> sometimes it's the place that are because of the mods that I have. It could be file issues and everything that's why we're having this a little bit of fps drop though but sometimes when you're on the road it's gonna be become better and okay how are you my friend i'm good i'm good thanks for asking how about you just suppose i hope you're doing okay as well thanks for asking my friend how far is this one 700 miles it's kind of okay The internet company decided to mess with Matt's internet when he started flipping on people. <laughs> it's like a violation I did. <laughs> right, Goof? <laughs> it's a violation I did. That's why they're, they're trying to punish me. Um, I had to call last night the ambulance to go... Huh? You had to call the ambulance last night just to go to the toilet? What do you mean, my friend? Did you have any issues at all about your... About your fight with nature? You have been shadow banned from all. <laughs> it could be, it could be. I could have been shadow banned from the internet. 
I'm actually more on a wholesome guy, so why could I get bad? Just because of that middle finger. Seems like you have forgotten me. Huh? What do you mean, my friend? I had to call last night the ambulance to go to the cellar. I'm the Finnish boy with bad knees. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I forgot that part, though, just suppose so. I forgot that part. I do apologize, my friend. Do I have to turn right now? Okay. So, how was it? I, I hope everything's okay now on your end. Why did you have to call the the ambulance? Do you don't have anyone with you at your uh, at your house? Is it just you? Why do you have to call them? Nobody can help you out. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I know that you couldn't walk. So every time that you have to go to the toilet, you have to call the ambulance. I live alone, yeah. Wow. So if you live alone, how can you... That's... Nobody could like... Why don't they just put you like on a... On a... Like a... A house... Care or a caregiver or something? Voila. What is a voila? Exit left. Exit left. Okay. We have to make a left. Dang it. This is kind of a weird type of expressway I've been to. This is the first time that I have this kind of left turn coming from a highway. Or just stay on, just stay on the toilet all the time. What? What's a voila? Ah, huh? switch. I'm kind of confused now. <laughs> But I mean, uh, in your government... It, I mean, in, 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 your, in your government, my friend, since you are... You have this... Uh, do, you, do you consider it disability already? I think it is, I think, right? It is part of a disability. Since you have that kind of situation... Okay, okay, gotcha, gotcha. So, just suppose, so since you have this kind of situation in your life, um, why why don't you... Oh, you just stopped Twitch bugging. Oh, just suppose, so thank you, my friend, Dan. Thank you, thank you for the support. I do apologize if uh, if Twitch is kind of bugging. Yeah, it looks like that it, it might pop up later. It might pop up later. But again, just suppose, so thanks for the, for the support. I appreciate it, my friend. Thank you, thank you. But again, question just suppose. Since you have this kind of situation, your government cannot like put you on a nursing home or a care home, a care home, instead of you living alone, and then you know that this kind of a situation happens to you. Is there nothing like that kind of a policy in your government? Poop up the day after the sub expired. <laughs> Come on. Goof, what was the views that you just posted? What was that one that you said that you will not reach the 20k because it's gonna be gone? <laughs> what was that one? Um, I, I think I can see it. I do have 16,000. Yeah, I do have 16,000 since I started August last year. Oh, I'm almost to April, May, June, July, August. Oh, four months ago, I'm gonna reach my first year anniversary then. Twitch is doing that stat in two days. Uh, what is that stat all about? Is it is it really relevant? I have 16k though, so I'm not so sure if that is a great achievement for since I started August. <laughs> August of last year. Oh, there you go. There you go, my friend. There you go. Yeah, boy. <laughs> now we just pop up. Again, just to post to my friend. Thank you. Thank you for the resub. I appreciate that. Wow. Currently on a three month streak. And just to post so, you know what will happen. It just activated it, nuke, my friend. Guys, can we do an exclamation love for just to post or hashtag? Just a post of thanks for the sub. I appreciate it, my friend. Bye bye, Earth. Earth, paalam. 
kaboom. <laughs> Just to post it again. Thank you, thank you so much, buddy, for always supporting the channel. Seriously, it means a lot to me. Thank you, thank you so much. What time is it currently in the U.S., Goof? 3 p.m.? Go away. <laughs> Go away. Man, that sub expired too quick. <laughs> Goof, are you currently um, at work or you're, you're at house? You're in your home. Yes. Which one? At work or in your home? Or you do work from home? I'm back watching again, boss. Thank you, Daniel. I appreciate that. It's 1.28 p.m. in Minnesota. Nice. So that's roughly 12, 7 p.m. Kalumkif, right, right, my friend? 7 p 7 28 p.m. Hong Kong. Oh, by the way, guys, um, I do have a couple of games that I'm trying right now. I have Two Point Hospital, which is a little bit an old school game that I played before, but this is the newer version. I do have Fishing North Atlantic as well, which is I really love, but I'm not so sure if it's gonna be a good game to stream. And I do have Fern Bus. I love the Fern Bus as well, it's really cool. So I'm gonna ask you this coming Thursday, which one would you like me to stream? Fishing North Atlantic? It's a fishing game, but you're using a big boat or something like that. Or the Fern Bus, or um, the 2.0 Hospital something. I forget the, the actual name. Theme Hospital was one of my favorite games. I love 2.0 Hospital because of it. Me too, Goofball. It was like especially the when they made that um, speaker announcement. It's really so cool. I, I mean, it's just like a, a nostalgia type of game when you play that one. It's just really so cool. I mean, the graphics is way better. There's a lot of new diseases um, and things that you have to cure so it's really cool but i'm not so sure if it's gonna be a good game to stream so i'm gonna ask you those three games which one do you want to see um the two point hospital um fern bus or the fishing north atlantic you know it's the same devs just a different company yeah de definitely um hopefully fr my, hopefully friend me so we can see each other very cool guy he is and very funny hopefully friend called me okay okay definitely definitely well you have a great time with him Emil and I hope that you will have a drunk session <laughs> just just you if you're if you're gonna drink don't drive don't drive you know just take just take the just take the the cab or something the hospital game seems like fun that's that's favorite is probably the one that matches your huh Fern bus is probably the one that matches your content the best. Okay, goofball. So goofball, fern bus. What is fern bus? Kalum Kip, it's a it's a bus game. It's a bus game. I would like to see fern bus. I don't mind. I will Okay, definitely Daniel. Drunk session. <laughs> definitely. Alright, so we're gonna do probably fern bus this coming Thursday then. And we're gonna chat, imagine this. You will not believe this. I was talking to the developer of the game, the game creator of Fern Bus. I was talking to him in Discord. Requested if he could, re if he, he could add this small feature that I needed for my stream, and I said, okay, which one is it? It's like this, like this, like that. Okay, okay, gotcha. Okay, it will be added on the next update. And then after probably seven or eight hours, they did a small update because of my request. I was like, what the f? Is that for real? I was like, you needed that for your stream, so we put it there. <laughs> That was really something. I was like, oh my gosh. That is really cool for them to accommodate my request and put it on the next update after seven hours after I requested it. So that was really, I would say, phenomenal for Fernbus to do that. And what was that? Oh, dang it. I smell something bad. Hold on, hold on. I smell something bad. What was that? What was that? 
Can you smell the chat? No, 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 I'm you. It smells like burned wire or something. I'm kind of afraid to start the engine again, though. But let's try. Oh my gosh! I told you this. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Boss movie, I appreciate that one. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Well, fart could also make a fire, but that was that one was uh, more on the electrical side. <laughs> so let's start to okay, guys. Seven million trucks down. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh my gosh, again boss to be I appreciate the support my friend <laughs> and always gonna put me on fire I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to happen that to me. Hold on. Hold on Okay, there you go. <laughs> Sorry for that <laughs> play with fire you get burned. I agree Derek. I agree <laughs> By the way chat again damn we lost the car. Oh no the cargo is still there by the way chat um, I would like to make this announcement because again I'm waiting for a game to call the day before. So the day before, it's a zombie post-apocalyptic genre type of game. So it's like a combination of DC and Division Two. So they consider they tag the game as memo RPG, but it's I don't know. It's just it's one of the games that I'm really waiting for. It's not a truck game, by the way. It's not a truck game. So, um, if you wanted to play that game, we can actually gang up or team up. So, I'm not so sure how it's gonna be, how it's gonna be like. I, I mean, I haven't played Daisy, I haven't played Division 2, but it's a combination of both games. So, I hope um, that you can play with me when the game launches. It will be launched this coming June. And a lot of people uh, wanted to try the game, play the game. So, it's one of the most hyped games. So, I hope. That you will and I hope that you can play with me. Um, damn, we lost the cargo. OD ate jalapenos and fart. <laughs> Actually, goof for jalapenos. I mean, I'm not really a spicy type of guy, so I haven't tried jalapenos. Have you tried it, goofball? I think they said this was it California Reaper, the most, the most spicy one. Which, which kind of spicy is the most spicy? Spiciest spice out there, spiciest spice. I'm not sure if that is if that is correct. I'm gonna turn left. Okay, all right, cool. Caroline, Carolina Reaper. Oh, okay, so that's the that's the most um, spiciest one. Is that correct? Okay, we're good. Boss Luby sending another 200 bits. Boss, with that one, you deserve a nuke. You deserve a nuke, my friend. Boss Luby, thank you, thank you, boss, for always supporting the channel. And I appreciate you um, being here. Thank you, boss Luby. Um, howdy all. Hey, what's up? Iron Bar? Iron Beard, 6 to 9. Regrets, boss. Thank you, thank you so much for that one. I appreciate it too. Um, did, I think they did a while ago. Um, boss Peter Sally, my friend, can you do me a favor to do another exclamation love for Boss Luby? Luby, my homie, my home. Is it my home? Yeah, my home. I can't keep buying new houses every day. <laughs> what was that? What was that? D -d Does Luby play a game that that probably? I, I don't, what was that comment all about? Is there is that like connection to a game that Luby played? Boss Peter Sally, do me a favor, my friend, to do the exploration love again for Boss Luby. You, oh, okay, okay, gotcha. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Thank you, Boss Peter Sally, guys. I would appreciate it as well. If you could kindly we hit the rail, if you could kind of check out Boss Luby and uh, give him a love and support. He's one of our friends here and family members, so I would appreciate it if you could give him a follow. Thank you so much for that one. 
We are doing Mexican in school next term. All right, back to work. Third, ah, uh, ten for a goofball. Ten for my friend. Ten for. Uh, be back to the kid, Daniel. Thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, boss. Oh, what was that, boss? Thanks for the love. You're welcome. You're welcome, boss. Tell them, Kif, what what do you mean by the Mexican thing? What's happening with my stream? Look at this. It's going crazy. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm gonna let go of the steering wheel. Check out Garfield. All right, check out Garfield and and the dog. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, look at this. And look at Gar <laughs> Look at Garfield. <laughs> <laughs> They're shaking their head left. I'm gonna do it one more time. That was that was kinda cool. <laughs> oh. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. That, that's enough, that's enough. Oh, give me a second. What's Doobie? What are you doing, my friend? Boss, thank you! Oh my gosh! Do you want me to buy food, Mexican food with those beanies? Boss Luby again. Thank you, thank you, boss. For another 200 bits. I mean, seriously, my friend, I appreciate everything that you do to support the channel. Thank you, thank you, boss Luby. <laughs> oh, hold on, you have discovered a new viewpoint. Discovered a new viewpoint. Where? Where's the viewpoint? Oh, in front of us. Ooh, ooh. Okay, okay, we do have a, a viewpoint. Cheapest natural disaster. <laughs> <laughs> Cheap is that? We're gonna do this checkpoint. We're gonna do this a viewpoint, viewpoint, not, not a checkpoint. So, chat, you know what happened when we do have a viewpoint? I, I stay quiet on the background and let's enjoy this lovely scenery. What SES did for us because for me, viewpoint is the best thing or the best part for me when I play this game. So, let's check it out. Um, and I'll be back in a minute. As always, as always, we are in a treat every time we do viewpoint. I just love viewpoint so much. Check the viewpoint or view the contact point. <laughs> oh, let me see, let me see. Um, what do I need to do? Lights. Um, and your break. Yeah, we're good. Let's go. Bus. Oh, dang it. That was close. That was close. <laughs> that was freaking close. Alright. How far are we going? 
550 miles ago for the second load of ours. So the load that we have is a big, massive rock. I would say it's a big, massive rock. <laughs> it is a big, massive rock right there. I don't know. I'm just, I, I'm just in love with my truck, though. How my truck looks is just, I don't like it. Do you like karate? Um, not, not that like I practice or know about it. I only do street fight, but nothing like a like a martial art thing. Why, why did you ask uh, Boss Kaloon gift? Is there anything? Um, it's a big, massive uh, Dwayne Johnson. <laughs> boss Doobie with another, another 16 bits. Boss, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Actually, let's use this horn. It's like a, a, a what we call this, um, a train horn. So this is the air horn. Listen to this one. And this is the, the regular horn. The regular horn sounded like more like a train horn. <laughs> um, you do karate. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Not, not on me, Boss Kolumkifa, right? We're friends, right? We're friends. So don't, so don't do karate with me. I mean, don't, don't chop me. Don't do the karate chop with me. Karate chop. Right? But I do love karate, especially when... Um, the, the movie Karate Kid was out Wait, The first one though The first one The first one The first uh, Karate Kid I was really a fun The walks in Walks out It's really and then, what, What's the name of the sensei again? Was it sensei Oh dang it I forgot though Mr. Kanudu Was it Mr. Kanudu? What was the name of the sensei again In Karate Kid? That's a nice truck Thank you Thank you boss Mr. Miyagi <laughs> Kanudu What? <laughs> That's a freaking far from Mr. Miyagi. <laughs> Kanudu. Where did I get the Kanudu? <laughs> I'm sorry. That was... That was bad. That was bad. <laughs> Mr. Kanudu. <laughs> that one, that one kind of Filipino whack me. You were on there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> But Mr. Miyagi was really Really a cool sensei though So that's the <laughs> Mr. Ka Ka I said Kanudu <laughs> Goofball Man Yes boss Yes boss goof <laughs> Sorry <laughs> um, This is Why the aliens <laughs> So, so goof. Okay. So I, I would I would say that I am a living defense mechanism then for Earth, because if alien will detect my stream and they will watch this, guys, let's not go to Earth, or else we will encounter Matt. It might be the end of our species. Is that what you're saying, goof? <laughs> is that what you're saying? Is that what your statement is all about? That I am the best. Way not for the alien species to invade us. <laughs> so the U.S. government might contact me. Matt, would you like to be part of our defense system? <laughs> sure, why not? It depends how much will we pay. <laughs> would that would that work, Goof? Would that work? I might be I might be streaming in Area Fifty One then. Intersection. So it's not really like a, a stoplight. More on like first come first in. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> Actually, there's there's a particular law that we follow in one of our. Um, it's in Subic. Subic is before a naval headquarters of the U.S. Navy, but now it's um, they're not here anymore. So it's turned over to the government. But in terms of the traffic law inside the U.S. base Navy, are still being followed right now. So there's not really a lot of stoplight there. But every time that you hit an intersection, you really literally have to stop. Irregardless if there's any vehicle or not. If you don't stop, you will get a ticket. So once you stop, let's say when I reach the, the intersection, let's say there will be one vehicle either on the left, right, or front of me. And when I stop, that's the only time they can go. And you have to let them go because they're the first one to come in there. I find that traffic law or rule really cool. But the rest of the Philippines, it's going to be chaos. But inside Subic Freeport, 
it's really a cool thing to that that type of policy is really amazing i like that one they start okay this is they start broadcasting boss matt grill into their <laughs> space is that like a an, an awareness program that they're doing right now boss goofball for them to avoid us it's going to be the end of us no kaluk if you just if you just heard or read what goof said i am the best defense for aliens not to invade us because like mr kanudu where did that came from right so they're trying to avoid to interact like kind of me <laughs> so th i think that's a good thing that's a good thing <laughs> how far are we 480 or 490 miles to go so kind of still far but i'm loving the the views here I, I love this kind of of look so by the way question goof is this kind of similar to how texas might look like would it be something like this because i i find this kind of of scenery kind of amazing and it's like i'm, I'm going back to the to the old west, wild western theme or feel that's why I, I wanted to see texas i mean checking the photos of texas it's it's kind of some of it are look like this but since goofball is from texas um can you can you kindly give us a little bit probably r and r on how might texas look like in general have you ever been to california Columbia, not even a single state in the u.s i have been that's one of my dreams to go to the u.s especially to texas because i want to have a signature of goofball <laughs> but seriously it's one of my dreams but if i'm going to the state i will go to texas because aside okay there are particular reasons why i want to go to texas first i have a lot of friends in texas including goofball and unless goofball considered to me me as a friend <laughs> but i want to go to texas um at the same time my favorite nba team is in texas as well san antonio and al also i've heard that texas really is massive and there's a lot of different things that you can see in texas so those are the, the things the reason why i wanted to go to texas but of course i want to go to different parts of the u.s as well um but probably if i'm going to the u.s the first state that i will visit is going to be texas west texas yes central texas is hilly and more greener vegetation and gets more green and forestry when you move east oh, okay okay gotcha gotcha so that's that's probably one of the cool thing about texas is that you don't have just one same kind of look or feel there's always going to be like a different type of 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 scenic view in terms when you go around texas that's probably one of the coolest thing biome what's a biome 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 what's a bit biome biodiverse is that what is that like diverse like uh like minecraft i don't i don't i never tried minecraft not a single time so i have no clue what's biome 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 is it like kind of diverse is that what you're saying or kind of like unique by omi by omi by omi <laughs> i don't know what's the meaning of that one by omi what's a by omi? can you can you can you do that in, in english word <laughs> <laughs> don't pronounce the e by o by om by om by om by om a large natural occurring community of flora and fauna occupying a major habitat forest or tundra ah okay that is an english <laughs> okay so uh, i'm not the english guy so please, please uh, spare me yeah that is correct okay gotcha by ohm okay by ohm gotcha <laughs> see i mean that's that's really i would say always gonna be my complaint so like for example goof when you when you say boss Matt is a is, is a is a Filipino, <laughs> I love how Goofball pronounced the Filipino though. Um, that's really one thing that kind of really until now, I would say half fascination, half confusion. Like for example, the biome, biome, whatever you say it. If you don't want to pronounce the e, why do you have to put the e? in it <laughs> you know what i mean why do you have to make it complicated i mean i don't know it's just is, is it just me or like for example it's say uh mount mountains you don't pronounce the t i think it's just a mountain something like that so why is it you have to put that letter if you will not even pronounce it in like a silent thing you know what i mean i don't know i don't know <laughs> 
boss man boss man boss man is a Filipino yes I am a Filipino Goof aside from English what other language do you know do you know how to speak Spanish or French okay so as far as I know for American people I think of course everyone do speak English and I think the second language that majority of American knows how to speak is it is it Spanish the next language that you know how to to use what will be the third would it be French so like for us here in the Filipino of course everyone can speak the Gallo but we do have a lot tons of dialect so but everyone almost can converse in English I can speak English as <laughs> vulgarity is not a language my friend <laughs> But I mean, aside from English, do you know how to speak Spanish, French, or even other kind of language? I mean, I think that's the most popular. <laughs> the FK index. It's, it's not. <laughs> oh, this oil tanker. I almost hit your boss. How to speak UK English? Um, I'm not so sure. Kalukif. I don't want to imitate as well because it might be racist. But um, British English is one of the cool accent that I've heard as well. I love the accent of, of UK. I love. The, but if you're really gonna ask me if I wanted to learn an accent, I wanted to learn the Scottish accent. Accent. I, I just find Scottish accent so fascinating. I don't speak any other language. Gotcha, my friend. I know a very small bit of Spanish, but not enough to claim it. Me, imagine me goofball. I'm technically 75% Spanish, but no habla español. <laughs> my dad is uh, a Spanish, a pure Spanish. My mom is 50% Spanish, 50% Filipino. So in reality, I'm 75% Spanish, but I, I don't know any Spanish word. The name Kalum is a gladiator from Scotland. Oh, nice. That is so cool. Oh, you want to be like me, Scottish? Yes, Daniel. I mean, I really, I don't know. It's just... Every time that I hear the Scottish accent, I know a lot of people doesn't like it because they, they, they have a hard time understanding, which I'm also this, on the same situation. Even though I love a Scottish accent, it's kind of hard sometimes to understand. But I don't know. I just like it. I like it so much. What language would you learn apart from Scottish? Um, I mean, not the not exact the Scottish language, just the accent. So the accent in terms of English. Um, probably if I would have the, the opportunity to learn a language, I would probably say Spanish and Japanese. Um, that's the the most top of the list that I wanted to learn. Next in line might be Chinese and probably French. Something like that. Biome refers to the community of plants and animals that occur naturally in an area, often sharing characteristics specific to that area. Biome, biome probably is the way that you pronounce it, also known as major life zone, is an area that includes communities of plants and animals that have common adaptation to the particular environment. Oh, wow. In the world, they in, in the world, there, there are seven biomes, typ typical rainforest, temp temperate forest? What's a temperate forest? First time I've heard this. Tundra, desert, yes, I know. And taiga, boreal, boreal forest. Grassland, savanna, yes, I'm kind of familiar with that one. But I'm not so sure with the temperate forest and taiga, boreal forest. What are those? Like any specific forest that I could probably um, relate that to. I, guess, I think Savannah's majority are like South Africa or Africa. Grassland is kind of like, yeah, I know grassland is. You're just making Minecraft scientific. <laughs> so are those, are those Minecraft things? Are those Minecraft terminologies?
are those Minecraft terminal terminologies or it's a real actual terminology? Oops, I'm lagging. I think it's one of my mods that, that's making me lag. It could be the home base. It could be the home base. Which character would you be from any video games? If you're gonna ask me probably a character from any video games... Oof, that's a tough question. Uh, probably... I want it to be... Either... Arthur? from Red Dead Redemption 2 that character but I don't want to die <laughs> I don't want to die or like uh, <laughs> probably aside from Arthur of Red Dead Redemption 2 I would say Neo of the Matrix that game as well the game not not, not the not the movie though because you're asking about the game so yeah Matt I played Minecraft since I was three but on the other hand you haven't ever played it yeah because for the reason uh, Daniel I don't like the graphics are we talking about MC if so check game screenshot and you will see something me and my mate just finished that took three two hours and three. wow how is it going so far so good over 4,000 how are you doing my friend Matt has never played Minecraft. No, never. <laughs> never. Not a single game. Not a single time. I've seen it, but I mean, I never, like, even a second, never step on any part of Minecraft. Um, because probably I don't like the graphics. That's the only reason. I don't like the graphics. Even my kid were wondering, seriously, Dad? Have you ever played SnowRunner? Yes, Kalum Kif. Played it, uh, finished it twice. And I just get get. F I mean, I blame it to the mods of SnowRunner. When I started playing SnowRunner, it's one of the games that I really enjoy a lot. I even finished the game really quick um, on the first season um, before the Tundra. The, before the Tundra was released, so I, I played the game and then I restarted it with mods. I blame the mods because it made me kind of like <sighs> with the game anymore. So if you want to enjoy SnowRunner, like the challenges in it, don't ever try any mods because the mods will definitely ruin how beautiful the game is. Oh my gosh, look at this sunlight. It's just amazing. Uh, let me see. Have you ever played? How are you doing today? Um, oh, we forgot to my boss. One second, did I miss anything? Daniel, check a screenshot. Matt, there is something called shaders. It makes the game realistic. Really? For what game active? I'm good, thanks. Hope you are well over 4,000. What, what, what game active? I don't like the pixelated or the box graphics, the box thingy graphics. Minecraft, really? Can you send me, um, Dragon, a video in terms of how Minecraft could become a good looking game? Like a video of it? Be back, okay, Daniel. No, no problem. No problem, Active. You don't need to worry about caps. I'm not really kind of kin to that one. I'm not really that strict type of streamer, you know. As long as it's not PG or something, you don't need to worry. You're, you're good, my friend. We're here to have time. I mean, have a good time. That's basically the bottom line. <laughs> How are you doing today? Iron B. My friend, thanks so again for the follow. Hey, by the way, are you in beer, my friend? Where are you from? He's actually your, our newest uh, family member chat in the channel, so let's welcome Iron Beer. Uh, my friend, where are you from? Okay, chat, get ready for um, flashbang in three, two, one. Flashbang, flashbang coming in. Told you. Boss, I have been wondering for a while, how did you get the Cobra Chrome CB? Cobra Chrome? Which one? This one? This one? Is, is that what you're saying? 
That wouldn't work. No problem, my friend. Is that what one you're asking? Um, this one is a, a modded truck by John Ruda. So it, it comes with it. It's part of that one. It comes with the truck mod. The cool. Yeah. <laughs> There's actually three different design of this chrome. I'm going to show you. Okay, you know what? I'm going to show it to you, chat. What kind of CV we can get. Oh, don't crash. Don't crash. Oh, my gosh. I have the real. Oh, my gosh. Really? Okay, let's stop by to a, a repair shop, though. Um, is there any one nearby? Mm, hold on. Let me look for it. Uh, where's the repair station? Service. Oh, there's one here. There's one right here. Let's drop by here. So that I can show it to you. Is there anything else along the road? No, that's the only one. Okay, let's try it to stop by there. So that I can send you or I can show you. There are multiple um, options that you can do with this one over 4,000. I'm going to show it to you later. HQ came in HQ. Yeah, HQ, um, a friend of mine, another trucker, over 4,000 asking, where did I get um, the Cobra CB? Okay, so it's part of the package that we have. I oh, gotcha, gotcha. All right, thank you, thank you, Opera now. All right, so according to HQ, over 4,000 is part of the package for the truck mod. So once you have the truck, it will, be, it will come with it. Matt, I can show you the difference myself later. Um, it depends um, active um, because I, I might do something after the stream. Because actually, currently, my goof, check this one out first. I'm gonna do something with the steering wheel. It's shaking, right? Look at Garfield. <laughs> it's shaking, but look at Garfield. That's <laughs> but um, because currently active, um, I'm actually looking after my youngest because he have a UTI. And then after that one, I have to prepare the hot water for, for my kid, for my eldest kid, for his school. So I'm not so sure if I will be free after, after this stream. I'll message you. I'll message you, active, all right? I'll message you, my friend. But we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> Miss Canada, you like that one, huh? Uh, what's the name again of, 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 of the dog? Is it oh, is it Audi or Snoopy? What's the name again of the dog? I forget the name though. Audi, okay, gotcha, gotcha. Audi, Audi. Long O. Oh, Audi. Oh, is that, was that, is, that, is that the better one? Oh, the... Oh, the... Is that, is that better? Like, longer? Oh, the... <laughs> That's exaggerated. I think it's just oh, the... Is, it, is, it, is that also how you pronounce the car brand? The A-U-D-I? Is it Audi as well or Audi? The car, A U D I. Which one is it? Audi, the first one, or Audi? I have all of. Or really over 4,000. Oh my gosh. That is so cool then for me to have those. Uh, much better your way. <laughs> Audi. Audi? The second. Okay, so it's Audi. Audi is the first, it's the wrong one. Audi is the correct one. Gotcha. That is so cool. Over 4,000. Is that an honor for me then? To have Garfield here and OD. <laughs> I'm not getting con a con I would call this um, kind of conscious in terms of to pronounce OD <laughs> with a little longer O <laughs> because of the presence of over 4,000. So we don't wanna we don't wanna disrespect um, Garfield and OD. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't control it anymore. It's like I, I have to pronounce it like. <laughs> I cannot say Odi. It's like Odi is kind of wrong. <laughs> what was it? A bypass. Okay, we can bypass. Yeah. 
You've been hit back. You've been struck back. A smooth criminal. It was better before Jim Davis' son sold them to Disney. Oh, okay. Why did he sold it? Because his dad passed away already? And they just want to get some money? Well, probably, you know, he cannot be... He cannot do the same thing what his dad did for for um, Garfield. So, you know, I think it, it's... I mean, if you're going to ask me, I would say... I would do the same thing because I don't want to destroy the legacy of my dad if it's not my expertise as well to do animation, you know what I mean? I think someone bigger like Disney would, would be the best way to, to manage that kind of legacy of my dad just in case it happens to me, you know what I mean? Because if I'm not an animator, if I can't do what my dad was doing, I don't have the same passion, um, I think it's better to sell it to someone who is on the same field like Disney. All about the dough. What I mean what what do you mean about all about the dough, uh, my friend? Can you elaborate on that one? This road is a little bit kinda Jim died. He died because of dough? Is that what you're saying? Money after he died. Who? The, who the kid? The kid or the dad? Oh my gosh! So wh wh why? Why? Why did he die? What's 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 dough? What's that? What do you mean by all about the dough? What do you mean by dough? I will try and get a video later. Ten for active. I appreciate that, my friend. I appreciate. It. I might. I might try Minecraft then, if that's the case. If it's really a good, good one. Dough is a snack for money. Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. Why did he die then for money? What happened to him? Why did he die? days Matt active thank you thank you my friend I know what you're trying to say I have seriously seriously active thank you thank you his son sold it after he died dang it that's really kind of hard to, to, to imagine you know? imagine like a, a, a long type of of, of uh, what do you call this work by a person all of a sudden it's just gonna be taken away by just because of money I mean, imagine the hard work that he puts Ugh, it's just so so sad to hear those kind of things happen you know what I mean? hey well, welcome back sir dog then five months also by the way you're the longest person I have subbed active my friend an honor an honor for you to support me all throughout this thank you thank you boss for 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 the support and love you gave to me thank you you ever played guitar no kalumkit i can do a couple of of notes but just like an introduction <laughs> just an intro but nothing really kind of serious <laughs> just an intro look at my wheel what is happening with my wheel it's always going local like that I think this is where we're, we're, we're heading. Yeah, I think this is it.
just gonna show over 4,000 the options for the CB radio. What kind of options do we have? Give me a second. So over 4,000, these are the options that you have. Hold on, let me just put some repair. <coughs> um, on the inside. So like this one right here. So here's the option, the Cobra 29. You have the Cobra LTD type as well. It's like a different one. So on, on the Cobra, there's like different types. So for example, the style one. You can get the blue, like a blue, uh, and then the green, like the back li colors will be different. Um, and if you notice as well, so that's hanging, right? So on the type two, the position of the of the CB is somewhere like this, and you can uh, see option green, whatever color you wanted, on the CB itself. Now for the type three, it's gonna be like this. So which one, um, over 4,000 or Sir Dog, which one do you think is the most realistic position of the CB mic? This one, the option three, the option two like this, or the one that I have, which is this? Which one do you think is the most better one? Or the first one as well, the Cobra, this one is way better. <laughs> This is like the old school, I'm not so sure. But I'm using this one right here. Is over 4,000 still there? Welcome to the family. Oh, we have a new follow. Oh, give me a second. Give me a second. Gotcha, gotcha, my friend. Okay, there you go. So yeah, there's another, the LTD type and the LX type as well. So you do have, I think that one. Okay, gotcha. I think that that one this one that i'm using right now sir dog am i correct yeah so do we we also have an option which is i don't know what is this uh th which one is more better over 4000 sir dog the ltd or the lx the lx the one that i'm using though i kind of like it because it's kind of black which one they prefer the first one to vote sir dog in over 4000 do you want me to use the lx you ha you want me to use the LTD over four thousand? You want me to use the LTD or the LX? Or the LX is way better. Like, uh, go first with the LTD. Okay, sure. Let's do that then. All right, let's use the LTD then. It's I think it's more common. Oh, um, give me a second for the new follow. I have a special shout out now. Um, for which one do you want me to use for the engine? The first one to vote. N14, DD60, or the C16. I'm using the DD60 right now. So the first one to vote, that will be the one that we're going to do. The N14, DD60, or the C16. I'm using DD60 at the moment. The first one to vote, that's, what, well, that's the engine that we're going to use. N14, DD60, or CAT C16. Which one do you prefer? First one to vote, that's what we're going to get. Who's gonna vote then? Anyone? Any engine you wanted? Come on. Anyone? <laughs> Which one do you prefer? N14. Let's go with the N14 then. Um, Uncle Rico. Okay, so let's choose the 800 horsepower then. There you go. All right, cool. Now, speaking of that one, we do have a new follow. Shout out to our viewers and follower, Leo Bin. Leo Bin is official. I thought I did pronounce your name correctly. But, boss, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the family. Um, thank you as well for Uncle Rico, the first time chat from him. All right, cool. So let's get out of here and start. I'm a fan of DD60. 
I have the others curious what the NFT sound. Okay, no problem. Legend Driver rolling around in this Peter build. Oh, the, the one sweetie. How are you, my friend? Hong Kong to you, brother. All right, let me just turn on the engine brake for you to hear the Jake brake. Um, lights, let's turn it on. Um, we do have a new follow as well. Give me a second. Shout out to Uncle Rico Boss. Rico, thank you for the follow boss. Welcome to the family. Right, so we're gonna let them listen to how the N14 sound, especially the Jake break. So we do have three stages of Jake break, but we needed um, a long road for, for, for us to be able to do that. So currently, the Jake break that you will hear is the stage one, the most lower one, okay? So that is how the N14 sound gonna let you listen to the Jake break um, stage one so that's a Jake break stage one later on I will let you listen to stage two and stage three but we need to have a little bit of I would say longer roads or high higher power try to put it to stage two so Jake break stage two right now oh I kind of like prefer the first one Stage three, but well, we don't have speed actually. It's kind of kind of hard to tell. Stage three, stage two. L later on, <laughs> let's do it on the outside road. Let's get some speed first before we do that. Jake, brake, sound check. currently at 7 here just waiting to hit this, the 2000 rpm okay we're clear to go in i'm good brother just finished clearing cleaning out my truck trying to cool off a bit done got out got hot out there moving cha chains to my shed nice nice my friend all right do you have uh, any trips today in the once meeting by the way guys the once meeting is a friend of ours and he's also a real trucker in real life right now. I'm going to try to run with you next time you do ATS. This time, I have still about two hours real time left on my candle load. Time for that boss over 4,000. We'll do that once you are free. Okay, I'm gonna, gonna do, I'm gonna start with Jake Break stage three. Stage three, stage two, stage one. Kind of prefer the stage one. Kind of like more, extra long gated type of gargle in it you know what i mean i think i prefer the stage one let's do it one more time let me just push the rpm a little bit more yeah yeah i, I agree as well rico so we're gonna start with stage three waiting for it hit to hit 2000 rpm before we let it go let it go let it go <laughs> dang it <laughs> all right we're almost there and it's kind of up uphill let's wait for uh, a flat line before we do it okay here we go stage three coming in stage two coming in stage one coming in i prefer the stage one this one's way better for me what are you driving um, um oh you're asking the one smitty here actually i think over four thousand he posted his truck in in game uh, under oh dang chat is starting to sink plug <laughs> um, over 4000 you check um 
I think uh, under car show your truck I think in, in our discord he did share his his rig it's it's really cool though I think he's driving if I'm not mistaken a western star was it western star or a cascade or a mac <laughs> I don't know I forgot I forgot though but he shared his rig in our discord I will look okay thanks everybody to make it easier just look for his name or it's just under our car show Check it in under car show. I think it's in car show. Sir Dog, this is the engine that you used when you were trucking, right? In real life. Am I correct, Sir Dog? This was the the engine that you were that you used. Okay, cool, cool. Let's open the window though. Let's give Sir Dog a more um like bring back down to the menu. Drive a heavy whole Mac pinnacle. There you go. Oh, look at this uh, view on the right. The window is kind of like makes the, the engine sound way more better. Over 4003 drive drive axle and a heavy duty steer axle. Oh my gosh, you want to see it? It's like one of the dream. Um, truck that I would prefer to, to drive as well or have. That is really cool. The ones we need. My friend, uh, the ones we need so far with your driving experience, how is it in, in general? Do you think that you really like it or love it? pretty but she gets the job well I think a Mac is this I mean for me I don't know I mean yeah, of course there might be something way more beautiful than the other trucks but any trucks out there I don't know I just when I see them it's just like, wow. I mean I just appreciate every single truck out there I never this I never look at the truck it looks rubbish or ugly even um, probably in the, in the United and USA scene I would say probably the less love truck would be the international. I appreciate still the international. Even the low lone star or load star. The kind of like the the, the kind of ugly duckling I would say in the trucking scenery for, for most people. But for me no. Like for example in ETS2, Renault doesn't have that much love, but I love how it looks. I don't know, I just never look at never look at the truck that looks rubbish i just appreciate every single truck irregardless european or american i like it i love the simplicity of driving no boss over my, sh my shoulder all the time oh, that's nice that's nice my friend beauty is in the eye of the beholder oh that's a cool thing to say that one over four thousand that's really spot on my friend i mean i don't know i just appreciate everything for trucking scenery i just i am a kw fan no matter what Kenworth is really a good truck. Kenworth is a good truck. So I mean to say that you are a fan of KW900 as well, over 4,000, my friend. Do you have the Highway Killer of John Ruda over 4,000? Hey, Mrs. Tuto, how were you doing today? A Highway Killer by John Ruda. It's a Kenworth. It's one of the good modern truck in ATS. Highway Killer, you have to check it out. In John Ruda. Uh, check out YouTube probably for you to better see how it really looks like. Or you can go to his website for you to have an idea how this, the John Ruda Kenworth is, how beautiful it is. accident on the left side so we do have we need to do a need to work ah 
uphill. Dang it. I hate uphill. <laughs> you need to make your RPM and shifting the gears properly and spot it and then this SUV just stop in front of us. Dang it. something i am good just tired not long got home from her Aww. well mrs tuton i hope i could make your day better but of course with you with mr tuton there on your end you will definitely have a great time when you watch because you're home already um i am uh, no i tried not no i tried to mod my own truck 10 for 10 for boss over 4000 um i love trucks of all types i want the series mac to daily drive back and forth to my truck i think that we, yeah that will be really cool once me like you have your own personal own truck for personal use not to haul anything that that is amazing that will be really cool like you get out of your house you drive this um mac uh, of yours just to go to your company to drive your your work truck that is really cool yo 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 vroom 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 Hong Kong to you. How are you doing today, Paxon, my friend? Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. I hope you're having a great day, my friend. Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. So, how far are we from our destination? Uh, 57 miles ago. We're kind of close already. Good to see you, man. Same here, my friend. As always, my friend. How about you? I'm good, I'm good. I'm having a great time, you know. I'm trying to go around US of A. Uh, currently we are heading to i think which part of the map we are currently um we just passed the dales i think we are heading to is this dallas i think it is dallas yeah i think it's part of dallas or it could be still idaho or colorado uh, no 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 colorado is kind of far why I'm feeling for you always like my brother? <laughs> it, it's just probably um, I might be your brother from another mother. <laughs> Am I correct with that one, my friend? I think that's the best way to say it or just to, 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 to look at it. Um, some of the trucks scale ahead and I can, be the, I can just submit an inspection. Where is the freaking... We just pass it by. And then you want me to go there? And the other truck stop the way is the other side what the f gps you only have one job that is to inform me ahead of time and now you inform me after we pass the area what the f gps imagine gps only have one freaking job is to let me know that there is something we have to do ahead of time but what she did she informed us after we passed the area good job <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was writing. Uh, so, see that, my friend. That's that's the reason why I'm your brother from another mother. Because we think the same thing. We think the same thing. It's just I said it <laughs> kind of ahead of time. Uh, Miss Canada, am I correct, right? GPS. This freaking GPS only have one job. That is to inform me that we have to do something, make a turn, or do a stop ahead of us. Not like when you just pass it. How can I go back there? You want me to do a U-turn? And then when I do a U-turn, you will let me know. Do a U-turn right now after we pass the U-turn. I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to rely with this GPS anymore. <laughs> I think we are lost twins. <laughs> but we found each other, my friend. That's that's the probably the, the best way to, to look at it. We lost, lost twins, but we found each other on the internet. <laughs> back so, my friend. I appreciate the, the, the love and support that you do to me. Thank you, thank you. We're gonna make her right. We're clear. Now we're clear. Nothing. No traffic. It's kind of hard to swerve from the middle to the right. So just to make sure that we are not gonna hit any vehicles. Bro, did you know that or heard about it at the time? Which one? I sell my wife for internet. What? Hold on. What's SELD? What's S-E-L-L-D? Did 
Actually, how did I already heard about it? And you mean to say you sold your wife? <laughs> huh? You need to check out it on YouTube. I think I have to. I have to. I think it's kind of interesting. You need to be also meme. <laughs> C can you can you can you message me right now, Paxoy, a link that I have to watch in YouTube in connection to that one? Can you send me a link right now for me to check it out later? And you, I mean, it message me either here in Twitch or Discord. And fam, by the way, if you're not yet part of our Discord, I would appreciate it. It will be an honor if you could be part of our Discord. Type exclamation Discord, and the link will be posted there so you can join our family and Discord. Man, promise me you will cry for a laugh. I think I will be my friend. <laughs> I think I will be. I'm already in DC. 10 for 10 for my friend. Thank you, Miss Canada, for the exclamation Discord. Hong Kong. And my steering wheel is going local. Look at him. Why the F? <laughs> Chill. Chill. Alright, here we go. The reason why it's happening it's because of the in-game configuration. But the, the steering wheel is perfectly fine. Nothing to worry. Uh, oh. there you go. How far are we? Eight miles to go, my friends. Eight miles to go. I don't want to sing. I don't want to sing. Because the last time that I sang in my stream, like seriously, this is what happened. I do have like, I think it was around 40 plus viewers. I started to sing, and then like in a single snap, from 40 plus down to 15. <laughs> and probably those remaining 15 people that's still watching me might mute me already. <laughs> so I don't want to sing anymore. I don't want to have the same mistake I did before though. <laughs> Unless you really want to push me to sing, then I would sing for you, Chad. Do you want me to sing for you? Or probably let's just leave it the way it is. Don't mind uh, trying it, Matt. Wait, this stream has... <laughs> Peter Sally! <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're a moderator and you burned me, my friend. <laughs> Thank you, Peter Sally. <laughs> Alright, so we're good to go now. <laughs> Don't worry, my friend. I will not sing. I will not sing. I will not jeopardize the stream. <laughs> Found the ball. <laughs> oh, what is this? Oh, it's a FedEx area. Ah, oh, hold on. I have to check with this guy. Hey, boss. Good day. What's up? What's up? Yeah, I do have a delivery. Uh, Package. Give me a second. All right. Um, it appears the sender's name is. Hold on. Document states here. The sender's name is Neo. Neo official something. Yeah, it's right here. Um, receiver's name is Uncle Rico. Is he here? All right, cool. So where do I bring the the, the trailer as well? Just inside the facility. Okay, okay. Cool, cool. All right, all right. Okay, I'm gonna do it now, my friend. Thank you, boss. Have a great day. All right, we just got approval from the security guard that the person that needs to arrive, uh, receive this one is here. All right, park it like it's hot. But before we proceed, I think that's the guy that will receive the package. So let's talk to him first. That's where we're gonna drop the load, I think. Yeah, it looks like. Don't sing, please, no, Boss Ray. What's up? I want, I want. Peter Sally, do an exclamation love for Boss Ray, please. Thank you. Hey, boss. Good day. What's up? I do have a delivery here with a, a big rock on the back. And then uh, a package. Um, it appears the sender's name is Neo Dean is official. Uh-huh. Our receiver's name, hold on. Uncle Rico. Is he here? Okay, cool. Where was Alright. Can you sign this document after I, I put down the, the load? 
Where should I put the load? Can I park it here? Where? On the other side of the side. Okay, okay. All right, all right. Cool, cool, cool. All right, boss. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. What's your name? Your, your name is Boss Dre? I am a fan, Boss Dre. I, I, I've heard your music on YouTube, Spotify. It's amazing, Boss Dre. Please continue making music for us, all right? Nice talking to you, Boss Dre. All right, bye for now. Such a great guy, Boss Dre is the name. Is actually a good friend of ours, a streamer, and also a music producer. Way to go. <laughs> All right, let's drop the load, drop the load. Can't be him. <laughs> Why is it? Why is it can't be him? That's where we're gonna. Who's that guy? His name is Boss Dre. He's a, he's a music producer as well, and I think he works in this logistics company as well as a part time job. But his main job is music producing. There you go. So this is where we're gonna drop the load. You sure? Uh, he said he's. I asked him, what's his name? He said Boss Dre. So I I I just believe what he said. <laughs> Are you not um, believing what he said? Where do I have to make a left? Right. <laughs> How are we gonna do this? I think I have to go back out. Having a hard time doing things. <laughs> this is making me tired. How am I gonna do this one? Give me a second chat, right? Give me a second. Those people at the back of the truck, please stop moving back and forth. I might hit you. The guy in the blue. Alright, thank you. There's a lot of people going back and forth in the back of my truck. Or my trailer. I don't want to hit them.
Give me a second, chat. I know that there's two. Seems like I have not enough room to maneuver this. Hey, Nor Andres, my friend. Thanks for the raid. How are you? I appreciate it, my friend. Thank you, thank you. I got a green thing, but I want to make the trailer in truck street, which is a little bit hard for us to do. I'll just leave it like this, you know. <laughs> All right, cool. Oops. It's not the most straight one, but that's that's. <laughs> Let's check it out, though. See, it's not straight, the truck, but the trailer is. It's good. It's there. <laughs> All right. I'll give me a second before I drop the load. Shout out to it's Jeremiah. Thank you, boss, and for the following. I appreciate it. Shout out as well to boss Nor and this morning, boss. Thank you for the raid. Welcome everybody to the stream. Um, let me see. Let me see. Did I miss anything? Crunchy, crunchy Apple TV as well in the house. Welcome back, Aloha. Um, did I miss anything from the chat? I think that's it. Yep. I'm good. Thanks. Thank you. Hello. Hello. What's up? What's up, everyone? All right, so let's drop the load, drop the load, drop the load. It's not the best green ding, but it's still a green ding. <laughs> Ron said, F <laughs> All right, cool. Let's get out of here and move to the loading area because we need to, we need um, them to sign the document for the delivery. Uh, give me a second. That's so dope. <laughs> All right, I'm having a hard time maneuvering the, the trailer and the truck on this kind of tight spot, though. So let's head to the guy first for him to sign the document. See? Yeah. So here's the guy. Where is he? Where is he? Oops. Hey, boss. Ah. Oh, my God. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, I was kind of like to. Um, so, I dropped the, the big. I think it's a limestone. I'm not sure. It's just a big rock. I do have the package here as well. Um, this package. Okay, the package was sent 
by its Jeremiah. Uh huh. And the receiver, I think it's a company. The receiver is Crunchy Apple TV. Oh, yeah. So you will sign this, okay. And for the load, the load was sent by um, Neo, it's official, and then the receiver is Uncle Rico. Okay, uh, you will sign this. Okay, uh, let me just reverse the truck. I'll come near to you. Give me a second, right? So he will sign the documents. We're just gonna reverse the truck so that we will be beside him. boss yeah what's up um it's your document just make sure to sign here and then the date and the time span as well yeah okay, let's wait for him to sign it off. all right cool thank you thank you and for the package um this one again was sent by um uh, it's jeremiah receiver company named crunchy apple team all right cool so here you go take the package i appreciate it all right boss all right cool we're good all right i appreciate it thank you thank you so much for that one all right you have a great day um i'm, I'm gonna take um a really quick tanski i'm just gonna eat my lunch where can i park here? uh right here oh beside the, the the security office okay all right cool thank you thank you all right you have a great day boss thank you uh so we're gonna park i just asked because i just want to eat my lunch before we proceed We don't want to block the sign here. We're going to take this one right here. And... Speaking of that one... Oh my gosh! It's Jeremiah! Jeremiah, my friend. You just did something. And you know what it is? You just activated... Wrong. <laughs> wrong button. <laughs> He just activated my nuke. Oh my. <laughs> I pressed the button for the fire instead of the nuke. <laughs> my bad, with Boss Jeremiah again. Thank you, Boss, for. For the sub, I appreciate it so much. Thank you, thank you, though. Uh, what else do we have to do? So we have the fire on. <laughs> What's happening with me? Give me, give me, give me a second, though. Um, I'm gonna s turn off the music. <laughs> All right, uh, then we're gonna play this one. There you go. All right, so chat. <laughs> I appreciate you everyone being here. Thank you. Thank you so much for for the love and support You know, we do have our second load for today. So we've been for two hours and 35 minutes today um, But I need to go but before I do before I do go I would just like to ask one more minute of your time Just one more minute of your time. We're gonna raid someone that's make their day happy and better um, but again, would like to make a big shout out to everyone being here. Thanks for the follow, for the sub, for the bits. There's a lot of you people to, to name a few. Um, Luby Gaming, um, the Jeremiah, thank you for the sub, um, and the rest people um, that subscribe today. And I mean, seriously, thank you everyone for being here. I can't remember everyone, but I appreciate the love and support. But um, let me see, let me see. Have a good night. Thank you, Darren, Boss Ash PH, with the lovely fire as well. Are dropping bams on him <laughs> yeah i do i back just had a bad roblox bar huh? bad rod hat rodox <laughs> they really know that one so chat um before i leave i always leave this message because it happened to me and it might happen to you but just in case you might be experiencing something bad you you have a problem you have a challenge whatever it is i'm just always gonna be here just message me and i'll be happy to listen to you make your day right and hopefully i can give you a good advice so chat that will be for me for today thank you everyone see each and every one of you thank you for being here 
I will be nothing without you guys. So thank you, thank you. Wishing nothing but the best. Have a great day. Stay safe. Take care. God bless you all. I'll see you tomorrow for another Your Truck Simulator. And I, one more minute. We're going to raid someone. Bye for now. Thanks, everybody. Hope you get the package crunchy apple. <laughs> guys, one more minute. We're going to raid someone. Bye. Uh, where's my where's my mouse? Where's my mouse? Where's my mouse? <laughs> there you go. Okay, let's see. The Who can we raid? Um, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Who can we raid now? Um, hmm. I'm thinking. Let's go raid. Uh, ho, 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 ho. Actually, I've raided almost all. You know what? Let's look for someone. Let's look for someone. That is. Uh, Okay, let's look for someone. Let's make their day happy. Right? Let's look for someone who is, I think, the serious. Okay, let's try this one. She has English, Cozy. Her name is um, Decode? No, uh, hold on. Yeah, I think this guy deserves it. Uh, let's raise him. His name is BB Elite Game. Alright, so let's give him a, a good time. And let's do this color Uh, wait, wait, wait. How did, where's my race bottom? Where is it? Huh? How, why can't I raid? What? <laughs> I can't click the raid bottom? Why is it? What the F? For real? Why can't I click the raid? There you go. <laughs> Alright, so let's raid this guy. He game. has six viewers. Let's make his day right. Let's make his day happy and beautiful. Alright, chat. Have a great time. See you tomorrow again. God bless you all. Bye for now.